Case closed tonight after a deadly crash involving a college rowing team. The police investigation into that collision last month in Vero Beach is now over. WPTV News Channel 5's Megan McRoberts reports the key findings coming to light tonight. Well, the case closed with the driver of a van carrying 11 members of a rowing team being cited for failing to yield to oncoming traffic as he made a turn onto the Merrill P. Barber Bridge here in Vero Beach. Among the key findings, the driver of a pickup truck could not stop in time to avoid hitting the van, which pulled in front of the pickup, according to newly published reports. The truck crashing into the front passenger side of this van where Holy Cross rowing team member Grace Rett was sitting. A first responder is said to have described repeatedly looking for ways to try and provide aid to Rhett, who died in that crash. The van's driver, Patrick Diggins, was cited. Reports state that Diggins had the green light, but not a green turn arrow. Diggins, who is also the director of rowing at Holy Cross, retired from the school just last week. Reports of the Vero Beach police findings come as a newly installed traffic signal has been activated at the foot of the bridge, a safety measure installed in the aftermath of the deadly crash. No one will be facing any criminal charges for this crash. I'm Megan McRoberts, WPTV News Channel 5.